Hi there and welcome back to the Thai, my friends. This is Ivan Rekan and we are looking for a part of Queen Sheba's sword here among all these quests about the nest of wipers. So we want to... Uh, what happened now? Um, come down here. Yeah, so let's see if we can find that thing, if it's lying around here somewhere. There are a lot of things lying around, and this thing... Ain't that the... No, that's just a decoration, I guess. Hey there, yeah, um... Let's see if we can have some kind of... Inspiration where this could be. Don't watch me like that. What's in here? Well, that's your home, I guess. Uh, okay, okay, okay. We might have to come back at night. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Maybe let's go for the nest of vipers first. But I've I've noted you down. I've noted you down, man. Now, in the last episode, we had ridiculous luck as we were attacked by a triplet of bandits that we sent here. On the wrong tra trace, like we <laughs> we talked them <laughs> into believing us, but yeah, they came and they wanted trouble. But the guards saw it, and so the guards killed all of them. Um, there's something else here in the. I mean, we might have seen that. when we were in there that someone needed something oh my goodness no 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 hands not today we want to solve that nest of vipers Really, we've been hurrying up to get these bandits down. We'll now try to finish it. Once and for all. The nest of bandits, where will it be? It should be around here. Well, that's not the nest Mixed of bandits. But that is where we'll find out more about that nest of bandits. So let's ride like the devil. Where do we need to go? Whoa, far north. Let's see whom we'll meet there. And why? Yeah, there's everything about the tourney at the moment, but... I mean, we're getting the practice, but we still need to learn some things that we have not adapted to. And that is going for clinches or something like that. And that could be... Like the thing. That sets us apart from the other opponents. Yeah. We've started to block now. And it's paying off. We've learned some strikes. We should use these strikes that we've learned too. But it's probably more vital to go for these clinches. I need to cross the river somewhere now. Uh, don't worry, it will come. Yeah. I mean, we're really hooked on that. Ratzik also told us, and so we're going for it. It's not about Captain Bernard anymore. This is about Ratzik. <clears throat> and Ratzik is actually... 
a man we like. I mean, he's all that noble and haughty and so, but... That's not the only thing he is. Why? Oh, that charlatan, our friend, is there. Wow, even... Even after Tomberg. Well, I think that's the way. Let's go. Maybe we'll need a horse with more stamina. I think we have the horse with the best carrying capacity. <laughs> Our Bicephalus makes us rich. That's the most important thing right now. See whom else we'll meet here. How are we armed, by the way? Oh my god, we need to equip our shield. What the? <laughs> we wanted to test our metal too with a with a battle axe, I think. Yeah, just for travel we'll use the battle axe. The best all-around weapon, probably. I'm not sure if that's true, but... No, we find it fun to use that as well, and so... And we've always dreamed to fight with a sword, but then we've discovered the strength of the mace, and now, after so much combat experience, we maybe are looking forward other things as well, also in the spirit of that tournament that is going on. Yeah. And we want some practice and if some never the welds yeah. come and attack us, like it has happened so often, we feel confident that we can resist them even with a weapon that we really don't know well. From our excellent blocking skills alone. Is that Merho yet again? That the... The Milnium Merho yet? Is that where Timmy... No, that was some Pesh, I think. No, no, no. No, let's have a look at the mill. Yeah. Is the dead man still lying around here? <laughs> we could talk to the sister of Timmy. One of the bandits and tell her what we did and that he's safe now too yeah. I think we should do that before we continue our path still lying around there he is let's see We've left a dead bandit here probably he's disappeared now right yeah, that's where he lay. Where's Mirka? She's still sitting outside, knitting. Who's there? It's What's me. That? Hello. So you, you don't want, want to talk. From me, do you? Yeah. Hey, well, I wanted who's to there? talk. Okay, all right. They don't want to talk. Has something happened? Yeah. Hey, who's there? Hey, who's there? Henry's come to see you. Yeah. How's that? Uh, mm. You want to ride in the totally other direction. Not that way. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. 
that could be the right one. Yeah, oh, that's the nice, nicest ride to Tomberg. Whoa, that path. So good. That's also where the horse race went. But if you're riding cross country, you're even, even quicker. That's what makes this so beautiful. So through Tomberg we must go. Whoop. I had to cut for a little interruption, that's why. Right, but we should look anyways, right? We need to go over the bridge and then north. Yeah, indeed, God save me. <laughs> yeah. Don't know what we're doing there. Let's see if we can help it with an axe. Uh, sometimes you can just ride there, you know. And that's beautiful. Is that the woodcutter's camp already? I believe so. Go to the fork with a ruined cabin. The fork. The fork with a ruined cabin. There's the fork. That the fork here. The only fork I know. These are not ruined. Hmm. Oh, there's, there's, there is a cabin that is ruined. Go straight ahead to the next fork by a clearing with a big birch tree. That could be here or here. Probably up there, right? That the birch? Well, it kind of looks like a birch, not like an actual birch, but it looks a bit like a birch. No, we're not yet there. Okay. I mean, I know birch trees. If I know any trees, it's birch trees. Birch trees are great. They're so practical, like they come back. Is that a fork here? Ah, there's the birch tree. Here, yeah, that really looks like a birch tree. 
left and what? Continue on the path to the next fork. And that'll be here or something. Here, yeah, that's a fork, right? That's a beautiful birch. I love this game. Oh, another beautiful birch. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to tell you every birch right now. I'm sure you know, though. I mean, who doesn't know a birch tree? Yeah, coming back to that, it's like the first trees that come back after after something is cleared of wood. Wood is birch trees. What is that? Maybe the the old religion. I I don't know what is called. Well, it's Slavic pagan or it's Sumonusko. No, that's Finnish, I think. Well, that could be one of them. Could we sacrifice here? Maybe we'll find a shaman. Could we pop? Wait. Okay, that has two faces. That one hugging the arms. That one also hugging the arms. They're looking... Oh, that one is talking or something. That one is just looking. Grimly. Is that an omen? Always stay behind. Always stay behind, Bucephalus. We've saved Timmy, eh? At least that. Hmm. A birch tree! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, at least we're not continuously sneaking, right? Confident enough that we could just walk or run away, maybe. I mean, what is really missing, that's out of character now, is that some bandits have horses and follow you. We've done that, and now... Take a left and carry on to the junction. Following him to, to like Alice in Wonderland, following the hare. Ah, uh, well, I'd say thank you for watching and happy gaming to you. We'll talk to this strange guy in the next episode. Have a great time until then, and happy gaming.